those of you who come late to church, you are not in service. You are out of service. You are out of order. You are coming late to church. Pastor is preaching. You are walking into the church. You are out of order. You are number. You are not in covenant. None of you here will go to American Embassy late. Visa to where? None of you here will go to German Embassy late. Because they gave you time. But you are appearing before the Almighty God late. Some people come to church, they won't enter. They will gist for five minutes, greet their friend outside. You are too casual and you have become casualty. It was a church and Anas and Safara died. Now, some of you are not aware that as we are here, there are heavenly hosts. That heaven is fully represented on ground. Now, if you lose the fear of God, you have lost everything. Lost everything. What on earth will make me come late to church under heaven? You are in church. Praise and worship has finished. Prayer has finished. You just waka come, waka go. Any time I'm officiating as usher, choir, my unborn child is involved. Timothy, remember your grandmother Lois and Eunice. Your children are involved. I don't see myself as your pastor. I am a servant of the Most High God. What a joy to be on duty for him. Ask anybody who has met me in the aircraft, I must preach. Left and right, I must preach. I must get your attention, you must hear my gospel. Service to God sustains your eyes. As I'm watching the church, I understand it's not to make church clean, it's to make my life clean. As I'm singing in the choir, I can't be offended by my department mate because we are here for different reasons. Uh, maybe this one came to wear uniform. I came for covenant. We are not here. We are not in this kingdom for the same reason. 